wet. <laughs> well, we're here at the Mission Reservoir. This is one of our favorite places. We're back here just to do a little short hike up to the lookout and figured we'd give our poles a try. It's not snowshoeing weather, but the poles I think are gonna help us get up in the snow and the incline we're gonna go up. Um, and yeah, you can see it looks pretty gorgeous. Here we are at the Mission Reservoir. We're starting the trail. We're not gonna do the full trail today. You can hike all the way up to these waterfalls. If you wanna go even crazier and even further, you can hike all the way up to Lucifer Lake, which is an insane six mile one way hike up. One day, I'm gonna do that. It requires some rock climbing and stuff, so not today. But there is about 15 minutes into this hike, a really, really nice overlook where you get a great view of the mountains. So today we're just gonna go up to there. We've been here a bunch of times. It's one of our favorite spots to go to. And I'm gonna tell you about some of the fun we've had here. Ford, not go down there. Please be careful, Ford. All right, so one of my favorite memories comes from this rock right here. So I worked for this DJ, his name's Timmy Trumpet, and he asked me to film a music video when I was out here. And we chose this location because of the epic scenery. We brought this dude out, his name's Micah. He's this crazy parkour gymnast from Missoula. And basically, I asked him how crazy he was gonna be willing to go for this music video. And we did a bunch of awesome stuff. We chased him around with a camera in the woods for a little while. And one of the epic scenes, he runs full speed and he jumps all the way off of this rock over to here. It's really dope. The music video is really awesome and one of my favorite things that I've done here at the Mission Reservoir. Here's our first obstacle of the day. They're very lightweight too, that you can tie them onto the backpack. All right, we are entering the steep part of the initial hike that takes you right up to the lookout. So this part is the hardest part of the hike that we've ever experienced. We've hiked about four, four miles probably on this trail before, almost to the waterfall. Story for another time, but this is the steepest part of the hike. It's pretty intense, but it's pretty short lived. And there's an epic payoff right when you get up to the top. Wait till you see this. Here we are at the Mission Reservoir. I don't, I don't really know what this is technically called. I guess it's called the Mission Reservoir Lookout. Um, but it's just a, a nice little overview about 10 minutes into the hike. We're not gonna go any further than this today, but we have hiked really far that way. Funny story about hiking really far that way. We were here with our dog and we went all the way deep into the woods. It was a beautiful snowy day, similar to this one. And we got probably about a quarter mile away from the waterfalls that you can get to. And all of a sudden we heard a really loud grunt or a bark or maybe it was a growl. So I don't really know what it was, but it was some animal that was way bigger than us that didn't want us there. Uh, Forge knew it, I knew it, Nicole knew it. So we very quickly turned our asses around and got the heck out of there. Uh, so always be careful, always keep your bear spray with you. And uh, if something doesn't want you there, don't go there. One thing worth noting about this place is these roads are not maintained for shit. So as you can see, there's giant puddles everywhere. And if you don't have a four x four vehicle or truck or something, you might be in a lot of trouble. So keep that in mind before coming to check out the Mission Reservoir. Look at them. Look at them just climb on up there.
So aside from the hiking trail, one of the best things about this is the reservoir itself. I mean, you can go swim here in the summertime, fishing here in the summertime. We've had some success catching fish. They even have campsites and picnic tables and everything. So you can camp here overnight and wake up with this as your epic view in the morning. Overall, this spot is one of my favorite spots in Western Montana. And we love coming here for a bunch of different things. It's good any time of year. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this video. I mean, we're gonna keep doing cool stuff like this in Montana, keep making videos, show you the coolest things that we've found to do out here. Uh, and I hope you can follow along for the journey. So hit that subscribe button, follow along, and come stay at Mount Forge. <laughs>